All right, what's going on everybody? Gamecock Chuck, got a good video for you guys today. South Carolina just opened up SEC play today, taking on Mississippi State at home. The Gamecocks, you know, a lot of, lot of people saying that the Gamecocks is going to finish at the bottom of the SEC. Uh, Coach Perry said, hold on, hold on, hold on. Nah, that ain't happening this year. South Carolina's going to make some damn noise in the SEC, and they did that today. Mississippi State came out smothering defense, locking down the game cuts. The game cuts couldn't get anything going the first, what, about seven or eight minutes of the game. And then all of a sudden, South Carolina just, they found their rhythm. They got it. They got in rhythm. They, they found their game. They started playing better defense. Uh, Michi Johnson, hell of a game from him today as they, as he took over the game. Um, led all, led, uh, led the South Carolina in scoring with 24 points. Uh, the young man went 9-11 from the free throw line. Great, solid performance. Down the stretch, he was able to put the game away with some key free throws. Like I said, man, South Carolina, it didn't look good at first, to be honest with you. It didn't look good at all. But Coach Paris and the game cost. This is a team. This is a team that's got a lot of fight, got a lot of passion, got a lot of grit, determination. Don't give up. This is this is what I like seeing out of the Gamecocks men's basketball program. This is something in the previous years would never happen. This team would have folded. They would have never got out of here with a victory. But today it's a new new era in Gamecocks men's basketball. They got the victory today, sixty-eight to sixty-two, to run their record of thirteen and one, one and zero in the SEC play. Like I said, a lot of a lot of people are, are doubting the Gamecocks, putting a lot of uh, doubt on them, saying how they how they no good, how the season. Uh, how their schedule, the schedule was pretty soft. And I get it. You know, there wasn't a ton of uh, of, uh, of big-time uh, teams on the schedule. I get that. But you still got to play these games. You got to challenge your team, a team that he's put together with some uh, key pieces from the transfer portal. And they, they stepped up to the challenge, and, and they showed what kind of determination and grit they got. Uh, today, like I said, Mississippi State is a hell of a basketball team. A hell of a basketball team plays some suffocating defense, and South Carolina found a way. Coach Paris made these in-game adjustments, and the Gamecocks just fought through it. Fought through it and took the lead, going into half thirty to twenty-eight. Come out with some fire and passion in the second half. Like I said, Michi, Michi Johnson Jr. led the way. Um, just phenomenal play from him. Miles Stute, Studi. 15 points, um, both him and uh, Michi went like 6 of 12 from the three-point line. It's about 50% from them. We didn't shoot great from the three, uh, not from the free throw, from the three-point line is what I meant to say. I think I said that. But anyway, they shot about 50% from the three-point line. Um, and South Carolina shot like 23 three-pointers. Uh, not crazy about that. We, we shot about about 40%, 39%, somewhere around there from the three-point line. Not crazy about all the three-pointers, but when we needed them, uh, we was able to knock them down, like I said. Um, great performance overall, like I said. Studi, Johnson, BJ Mack, all the guys. Hell of a team win today um, over Mississippi State. Uh, South Carolina uh, was plus nine on the boards. They, they fought and got all the loose rebounds when it was necessary. And uh, – I like to hustle. I like to fight at this team, and I hope you guys do too. Um, great crowd, great crowd for the men's basketball. I want to say that as well. I was a little skeptical about the, the crowd and whether or not they would show up today and be loud, but they didn't let Gamecock Nation down, and uh, they were rewarded greatly for, for their efforts of coming out and cheering for them with a 68-62 to victory by the Gamecock. So, like I said, a lot of doubters out there that is doubting Coach Paris and this team. Y'all need to calm it down. You need to calm it down. I'm telling you, this is a whole different team than in the years past. The second year under Lamont Paris, I, I, we're headed in the right direction with this program. I'm feeling real good about it, and I hope you guys are too. Jump in the comments. Let me know what you guys think of the, what y'all thought of the game. Um, let me know what y'all think of the team. Uh, we do need to clean up some turnovers, some bad um, um, bad passes and things like that. Need to clean that up a little bit. Uh, hopefully, Coach Paris will uh, keep preaching that, and uh, hopefully, his team will will, uh, will uh, get away from having some sloppy ball play. I guess you could say. So, like I said, get in the comments. Let me know what y'all thought of the game. Let me know what you guys think of this team. SEC plays underway, and South Carolina started it off right today with the victory over 
uh, Mississippi State, which was a which was a favorite in this game. Second line was a home dog, by I think it was like minus three point or plus. They were minus three in this game. So, hell of a win for Coach Paris. The guys, Michi Johnson, Miles Studi, all these guys hustled, fought, and played their butts off today, and they were rewarded with the victory. So with that being said, we're off to the next game, which will be Alabama Tuesday. We're on the road at Alabama Tuesday night, 7 o'clock on the SEC Network. So looking forward to another hard-fought contest for the Gamecocks. Hopefully we, can, hopefully we continue to build on this. This is our best start since like the, what, 2015, 16 season, something like that, 16, 17, somewhere around there when we had that magical run. Off to a hot start, and uh, the sky's the limit for this team. So like I said, do all them things. Hit that like button. Subscribe if you're a Gamecock fan and you're new here. Hit that subscribe button. Help this channel grow. I really do appreciate you guys, and uh, let's go Gamecocks, baby. Y'all have a good one.